And we are back, fellow knife enthusiast. The next knife brand spotlight has arrived. It's not bad, guys. The spotlight's on SOG, specialty knives and tools. Well, all right. Guess what SOG stands for? I mean, you're all about the acronyms, so. Hmm. Southern something gospel? I don't know. Well, the one you said beforehand was funnier. What was that? Some other girl, that was better. Some other girl? Yeah. Want to do a retake? I'm no. just kidding. Uh, close, but no cigar. Uh, SOG actually stands for studies. Spit on the ground. <laughs> that's, that's good. No, but studies and observations group. So, yeah. Uh, they began with members of a classified that makes a lot of sense. U.S. special ops unit known as MACV SOG. So, like nerds in the library. I think they were studying nerds. and observing. Okay, carried a unique. I don't think the. Okay, carried a unique combat knife into the jungle of Vietnam on covert missions. Ooh, I mean secret. Oh, really? <laughs> wow, way to talk down to them. Good job. <laughs> I was you were kidding. You know, you see my <laughs> sog knives. I gotta salute many over here. I'd really like to show you up close. Oh, would you? Would you like to I see don't it? think I need to. Come at me, bro. Come. At me. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay. That knife, in 1986, inspired a young designer by the name of Spencer Frazier to found SOG specialty knives. The tools was added later. <laughs> was it? Yeah, I, I don't know. I just said According that. to SOG, he reproduced the original SOG Bowie to pay tribute to the special ops unit that he uh, had created it. But, but what began as a single commemorative model soon snowballed. <laughs> into a full-fledged line of innovative tools, filled proven by the U.S. Special Forces, and even honored as the Navy SEAL knife of choice. Now they are known for producing a wide range of knives. And axes. And multi-tools. We've chosen a few of the most popular pieces from each of those categories to show you guys, and we will speed through them along with a few of our favorites. There's tons of them. Yeah, there is. And make sure to let us know what your guys' favorites is by leaving a comment down below. Don't forget, we also need those likes, shares, and subscribes. So. Subscribers, 19 bills, baby. That way we've got to something to show the boss, you know? There it is. And so you guys can see any new content that we post. Giveaways. Come on now. Giveaways. Free stuff. That we happen to have any time. That we happen to start. Start. Hmm? We don't start nothing, won't be nothing. Oh, I get it. Ah, okay. I'll make up for it later. <coughs> Will you? You know what? I'll put one on a tee for you. Then let's start oh. with SOG knives. So, on the table, how was that? Today we have the SOG Seal Pup Elite, mm -hmm. the SOG Pentagon. What? I like the Seal Pup better. I like the Pentagon. What? And we're really, we're really speeding right Look now. Look at this. The SOG. Wait, 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 wait. Stop for a second. Crimson Jihad. <laughs> Crimson Jihad. No, I, I can't. Sog Terminus. Am I doing that? I don't think I'm doing it right. It so takes some talent practice. Just flip it around like this. I think this one needs a little bit Pretty of soon oil. I'll be at the hospital. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Good like, job. Like a Wii remote at the All TV. Right. And the Sog Trident Elite. Wait, did we already do the Field Pup 2? Nope, show them out one Field too. Field Pup 2. It comes with a black leather sheath. We're speeding mm. through because we did these. Bill Pup's on sale, by the way. Got a bunch of them. He has no idea what price it is. 31 bucks. <laughs> At AtlantaKnife.com. There you go. And there's the Trident Oops. Elite. There we go. Not on sale. <laughs> go ahead. Okay. Okay. Um, don't forget, we also have the Heavy Duty SOG CLXR. Um, not extremely popular. It's going to be popped on the screen. Where are you looking at? It we is very We sold popular. the last one, so... Yeah. They sold out. But uh, it's my favorite SOG fold. We only so. got 12, and they were all gone. So, All right, a little bit about each knife. You want to hear something about them? Okay. SOG Terminus. Great knife, D2. Woo. Got the... Pivot lock. There it is, yeah. baby. We love that part. Comes I in love the crimson playing with this too. thing. The Crimson Jihad. Do me <clears throat> Why would you say Crimson Jihad? That's what they use in uh, uh, the movie with Arnold Schwarzenegger. When he's like, the Crimson Jihad has come to your country and will destroy one target every day. 
It's like, battery, battery. It's like, get the battery out the truck. All right, go ahead. I'm, I have wimpy hands. There we it's go. all right. doesn't matter. Ah, I got it. Okay. We love the SOG Pentagon because it's double you edge. Oh, serrated. I do like the dual edge, yeah. That does make it pretty good. Feel Pup 2. Can't beat that. I don't think we need to say anything about On that. sale leather sheath. Come on. It's great. It does have a slightly larger handle than the other ones, though. All right. But we don't, let's move it on. They're all okay. available. <coughs> Let not. Dot com. com. Yes, right here. Where we keep it. Let's not to forget. Let's not forget some oh. of our past populars. Like, look what I have hidden. This would be the Vulcan Eleven Ooh. or two. Like I'm not that. even sure. Him Roman, Roman numeral things really, <laughs> really, really trick me. Ooh. This is the Chap your old there. friend of mine, Sog Salute Mini. I don't think this one's available anymore. I've had this thing a long time. You can tell it's been beat up, locked back. That's what nice. I got hidden over here. Uh -huh. And Joel's got some others. Uh, like the Twitch 2. Yep. I don't have them hidden anywhere. No. Um, the Aegis, the Pillar, the Zoom, the Sog Saw, which is very popular. The Sog Creed. Not to be confused with Creed Bread from The Office. Yep. The Sog Super Bowie, which I think we still sell. I don't know. that. I feel like that would be because that was like their... Uh, I think we do. I think it's 129. Yeah. Where that came from. And Sog's first folding knife that was debuted in 1988, winning the overall knife of the year at Blade Show. The Sog Tomcat 3. Point zero. I'm a bit tired. Yeah, take a break. Is it break time? You know, working for the weekend now, so. I don't know. I hear if I get laid off, make more money going home. <laughs> no. <laughs> We're actually coming to you from our home. <laughs> That's right. You're over there. Can I just. So we need a person standing as a wall. Where's I think we just make that an meter? inside joke. Oh. But you can still do it. <laughs> And let them figure it out. But I'm going off the deep end. Working. For being near my mother-in-law. Almost 24-hour basis. I mean, That's <laughs> speaking be so of which, next we have Axis. <laughs> Completely unrelated. Um, yeah. The most popular would have to be the Saw Camp Axe. Or the, the Fast Hawk. Go the ahead. Throwing. Will you let me get there? The Throwing Hawks, the Tactical Tomahawk, and the Fast Hawk. Yeah, I will say the Throwing. Uh, Hawks right now are going oh like my gangbusters. I, I can't even keep them in. Ten or twelve a day. Ten or twelve sets a day at least. It Maybe is, more. It's a lot. I mean, we also tested the um, ability and durability of the saw camp axe in the past video, along with I think like the Condor axe, uh, mm -hmm. the East Wing axe, and off the grid tools yep. axe. I actually believe see through. Was it this exact? This exact one. Yeah, through it, granny at style. At a tree trunk. That he was making into a bench. Mm -hmm. It's stuck in the tree like it was made of glue, buddy. <laughs> Even though it isn't a throwing axe. Um, links in the corner description. You want to check that out. Okay. Okay, so. This is the only one I think we have at the table right now. Because the other ones are, we were sold out of the other ones, so. Oh, we have a few other ones, but I didn't go get them. They're clam packed. Yeah. We had to bust them all open. Then we'd have to keep them. <laughs> oh, you know <laughs> what? We, we should have. We should have done that. Fast talks are my favorite. Yeah. Uh, the camp axe, I like it. It's a nice little axe. I mean, I kind of like a wooden handle camp axe. <gasps> no. Yeah. No. I actually like a little mm -hmm. cheap marbles. My but, favorite is the camp axe. Yeah, okay? I know. It would I be. like it, and I like because the the butt of the axe head, you can use it to hammer things. Yes, okay? you can. And it doesn't damage easily, as you can because. tell, because this is the one that through, and you can't tell. Which is good for someone like me who isn't too skilled with when it comes to like. Axing. I mean, can I use axe as a verb? I don't see why not. I mean, we use jimping for about every other part of speech. Because so jimping verb, is actually a verb. Adjective. Okay, but if we say it has a jimped flipper, that is an adjective. I'm describing a noun. If and you say so. It has some jimping. That's a noun, not a verb. Yeah, I think look at that OSU back. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> that OSU to English degree is paying off every day. Okay, that I mean, without us... all that, the Bucky Beaver would not be able Shh. to say jimped. Shut up. Jim's an adverb. I'm gonna what? Shut up. That's an exclamatory speech. <laughs> I didn't say it like that. Uh, Anyways, I that get brings compliments us. Compliments on the hyphen. I'm about to hyphen you in a second. <laughs> that brings us to the last category for SOG: multi tools. You know, and they what? got a wide range of those too. We're not being serious enough. <clears throat> oh, I'm good. Most popular multi tools Serious. would be the, uh, well, gosh, there's tons of them. There are. The reactor, the power access, the patent series, uh, the micro tool clip, the power liter. And there are others like the power lock, power pint, and the sink, one and two. Uh, switch plier, bite, and I like the bite. pair of shears. 
We couldn't bring them all to the Knife Brand Spotlight. That would be like a 40-minute show, okay? We know you don't want to see us that long. <laughs> well. Actually, we don't get paid to do all that. That's good. That's good. On the bright side, we do have the reactor. Ooh. One of my personal favorites. I'll show you guys. All right, so this multi-tool is 5.25 inches overall, 3.75 inches closed. It's stainless steel with a bead blast finish and has additional black finishes throughout. Comes with pliers, wire cutters, a crimper, a bottle opener, Phillips screwdriver, large screwdriver, magnetic one-fourth hex bit, a uh, bit storage in the handle, gripper, pocket clip, which is right there. And if I can... There a blade. Is. Yes! An 8CR 13MOV knife blade. There it is. No, a blade. A blade. It's, it cuts. Your knife, it will cut. I like the reactor a lot because it's a nice, easy little carry. Um, you know, it's it's not it's compact. the center drives like the <coughs> Grover's, but those are all $100. This yeah, is half that. It and is. they're heavier. They're about a pound. This and is this not, thing is not. Right. This is like, I like it has a blade. Throw I don't it in know your why pocket. so much. I know I have plenty of knives, but I like if that part. If you ever had a pocket dump, this would be one What's of What's your things. favorite? Multi -tool. My favorite? Yep. I think it's the reactor. I Bam. like this. And when you know what? I like the bit, too. I didn't take it out because... Oh, those little things? I just got it. I like those. It's it's cool. It's I basically just, a bottle uh, opener, but, you know, there's a few things for uh, hex bits. I forget to bring them. Like, I have the Civivi one somebody gave me. I put it on my keyring. And ring. I have the gonna put it on my one, the hex thing. Yeah. I don't know what to do with them. I lay them down, and I don't ever I see like, them again. I like them when they have this, because it's, it's really inexpensive. It's basically like a bottle opener. Mm -hmm. And you can attach to Molly webbing or something like that, because they have a different version where it has a... Yeah. Uh, hooks on the ends. Mm -hmm. I mean, whatever floats your boat. It's handy, light, and come on. You pull it out of your pocket. It looks freaking awesome. Bad. It's a skull. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, bad to the bone. Finally, Sog also sells the Dark Energy Heavy Duty Flashlight, various packs, entrenching tools. Ooh, or shovels. Don't forget the entrenching tool. More commonly known as shovels. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> Machetes, watches, interchangeable blades, and replacements, and sheaths. <gasps> Like the very popular black Kydex sheath we have here. Let's upgrade Once your field up. pup from leather yeah. to Kydex. They also have the popular saw countertop sharpener, hex bit accessory kit, wire strippers, and as always for C. Most importantly. The SOG SS pint glass. I always say if you don't have a flask, a shot glass will do. You always say that? Ah, along with this, unfortunately. That's the end of this week's Knife Brand Spotlight. Don't forget to follow us on all the social media pages, especially Instagram. My personal favorite. Actually, I don't need to say anything else after this. <laughs> As always, I'm C, and this is... Joel. Just Joel. Yep. And we are signing off.